being back to the University of Houston means everything to me. Uh, I mean, you know, it's definitely, as I said in the press conference back in April, it's definitely a, a dream come true, dream job. Um, everything has been uh, has been incredible. The people have been incredible. The fans uh, coming back have been phenomenal. Uh, I feel like we're we're really close to to having uh, between 400 and 500 season ticket holders, and from a you know from a year ago with. Uh, you know, an average of you know barely 300 a game of home attendance. You know that's that's been a that's been phenomenal, and I and I put that up on you know our our marketing and and, and our administration, and very grateful for that. Uh, this season, as far as coming back, I mean, you know, we're you know we are. I mean, we I, I'm not hiding to be behind anything. You know, when we certainly don't mean with any kind of arrogancy. We don't see you know we're you know we're gonna as I told you know as I've told others. You know, my dad taught me a long time ago. You know, to to walk. You know. Walk, walk and speak softly, but carry a big stick, and that's what we plan on doing for you know until until April comes. And uh, you know, I, I really think if we do that and continue to work hard, everything else will take care of itself. You know, the the upperclassmen, the the six seniors have done a, a really good job of, of helping out the underclassmen and the freshmen and the sophomores. And you know, quite frankly, it's a it's a completely different system. It's a completely different uh, scenario for for even the seniors and juniors as far as you know the the things that we're doing and the things that we're trying to work on, but. Uh, I've been really, really pleased with uh, with their leadership and the way they've they've stayed positive and and have helped us coach the the underclassmen as well. A uh, practice has been very interesting. It's different having so many people here, but um, we're we're getting it. We we've had the run for messing up so many times in a row, and we're trying hard to keep our. Uh, younger teammates up, but it, it's going better than I thought it would. I mean, you know, you, you get a conference player of the year, you know, reigning conference player of the year in Courtney Taylor, and you get a thousand point club member is, is Brittany Scott. And, you know, I even, you know, I, you know, I even go further than that with Brittany Mason and Leslie Mason. And, you know, I, I think that, you know, with the senior laden team as it is, uh, we, we, you know, have a, have a lot of, uh, a lot of goals to accomplish uh, uh, this season. But me and Courtney played against each other in high school just once. Uh, they actually beat us, <laughs> but um, I mean it's it's fun, it's exciting. She, you know, she's also the player of the year, so I mean we just all we have to do is get better. That's what we're working on is getting better. I think it's going to be good because we already played three years together basically, and bringing us back is going to make us stronger. Um, I think we worked really hard this summer, and I think that it's all going to pay off. We're um we're closer this year than we've ever been. So I think that leadership in all of us has shown, not just in like the three seniors or the seniors that's here, but the point guards and it's like trickling down. So I think it'll be a good thing for everybody.